Hey guys, my name is Josh. I just went poop. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. You know, I've always been so good at intros. Hey guys, welcome to my channel. So I am obsessed with face masks. I try to use a face mask like once or twice a week because that shit is so motherfucking good for your skin. When you feel like you are breaking out and you have nothing else to go to, bitch turn to a face mask. The fuck? So, I finally did it. I hit puberty. No, not yet. Um, I got the carbonated bubble clay mask. Beach! And I am literally so excited to do this. Obviously, we all have seen this face mask everywhere. Like, I have seen it all over YouTube, Instagram, Facebook, Snapchat, Twitter, Tumblr. Visco, I don't know. But the truth is, and I'm not even lying when I say this, I have never watched an actual like tutorial unboxing video of this. The only thing that I have seen fully is like one of those Instagram videos, but those also are like only 60 seconds long and they have music playing over them and stuff like that. So I really know nothing about this face mask other than that it blows up on your face. So I really don't know what the end result is. I don't know if it moisturizes your face or if it's like a deep clean, you know what I mean? But it is a clean clay mask, so I'm guessing it's like a deep clean kinda, cause usually clay is a deep clean. I really don't know if any YouTube videos do, but at least in the Instagram ones, they never like tell you how it feels on your face, like when it's blowing up or what it feels like after, so like I'm really interested. I got this off Amazon and it was like 12 or $13, which is kinda pricey, but you have to remember you're paying for like the fun of it, like you're paying for the experience. Because I'm sure, well we haven't used it yet, but I'm sure, well like, and I just threw it across the room. There are face masks in the convenience store that are like five or seven dollars, which do an amazing job. So maybe this face mask is amazing. Maybe it's not. All I know is that my face is about to be a bubble and I'm a little bit turned on by that. Okay, so I washed my face just to get the disgusting, greasy oils off my face. And now we are ready to motherfucking dive in. So I'm gonna use the little bit on the cap because we do not want to waste any. I also want to see how many times this can be used. I guess we'll find out. The texture is kind of like gelatin, like it jiggles when you shake it. If anyone was wondering, yeah, I hate this. Like, what the fuck is this? Like, I hate applying with this. Fuck this. I don't know if you're supposed to do this, but I'm just gonna apply with my hands. I really don't give a fuck. Oh my god, this literally feels like putty. Ew. Okay, I'm gonna go to the mirror just so I can see what I'm doing. I'll be right back. Okay, so I just put it on, like, literally, and it's already bubbling up. Like, as you can see, it's like this dark gray color, and now it's this light gray color. I know it's not the most sanitary way, but applying with your hands is so much more easier than using this little butt plug shit. So this is what it looks like right now. It like tingles your skin, especially when you talk. And then other than that, you just feel like this like pop, 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 like all over your face, if that makes any sense. And it's very like lightweight though. Like I, I feel like I have nothing around my mouth right now. This is what it looks like right now. I'll check back in with you guys in like three to five minutes and we can see how big this motherfucker can get. So like, what's up? Just chilling. I literally cannot breathe out of my nose at all, but it's kind of cool because it like has taken the shape of my nose, but just like made it bigger. Like it's just so weird. It definitely like droops down too. So you just have to be careful about that. I'm surprised it hasn't gone into my eyes, but I think my eyelashes are protecting that but it literally feels like so weird. Like it's just like a lightweight, like, it's so lightweight, but it's so like, it's just such a weird feeling. So it's been like five more minutes because I really wanna see what happens. And it's definitely starting to like crust up. So I really think it's time to remove it. So it's said to get tepid water, whatever that means, and then just like massage it in. So I'm just gonna like wet my fingertips with warm water. And then I'm just gonna Massage it in. Oh, oh my god. 
it's so weird like the outer side is all bubbly and then like this part is like actual like the clay still so it's kind of like sticky and like feels kind of gross not gonna lie Okay, so I think I got it completely off. Ignore my pedo stash and my pedo beard, by the way. I'm just so lazy to shave. Not gonna lie, it was kind of hard to get off my face, like wash off. And that's kind of annoying to me. Like that turns me away from face masks. That's why I don't really use my Ben and I clay one, which is really bad because it's such a good face mask for your skin. But I just, I don't know why, like when it's hard to get off, I just hate it. Okay, so I'm back in my room. Sorry for my hair, by the way. The struggle is real. So this is what my face looks like right now. I'm sorry, ignore all my pimples. I'm working on it. I don't know, it's not like the biggest difference. Like I said before, the much cheaper masks from like convenience stores do a better job, I'm not gonna lie. But you really are paying for like the fun of it and it was fun, like this is so much fun. One of my favorite things to do is like find great or fun masks and just show my friends. So the next sleepover or whatever, I'm gonna whip this one out and they're gonna be like, Bitch, and I'm gonna be like, bitch, and they're gonna be dripping. But yeah, this really was fun. Like, this was so cool. So the only negative side is that it kind of was hard to take off, and obviously it didn't have, like, an amazing effect. It's not like the Jesus face mask, but it is really fun, and the usage amount... Usage amount. Is that like a thing? I really don't know, but it's like really well. Still have like a shit ton left. And I put a good amount on my face too. So I'm just gonna guess you can probably use this around like 20 or 30 times. So I think that's all that I have to say. If you enjoyed this video and you thought the bubble clay mask was cool, make sure to give this a thumbs up. Also, thank you guys so, so much for five hundred subscribers that actually is a pretty big deal to me and it means so so much so thank you so so much to everyone who watches my videos likes my videos subscribes to my channel i hope i make you laugh or smile at some point if it's laughing with me or laughing at me either way at least i made you laugh but yeah thank you guys so so much again like actually thank you so so much i'll see you guys in my next video and i hope you have a fabulous day bye guys Preacher man, I've been playing with the heart like a violin. I've been summoned through the door at the 6 a.m. Fix my soul so I don't lose a love again.